Alors, good evening, or should I say good morning? My name is Aidan, and I've decided, as any self respecting person in 2019 probably should, decided to start my career as a vlogger, which apparently is the thing to do uh, in this day and age of modern technology. As you can see, it's um, uh, actually nearly one o'clock in the morning. It's kind of dark outside and I guess my inspiration for this uh, new vlogging career is the fact that I can't sleep. Anyway, so any good uh, vlogger obviously needs uh, something to talk about, as indeed probably do the bad ones. Um, so what should I talk about? Well, one of my great interests and passions is cheese, believe it or not. So I'm going to talk about Italian cheese. And just to prove that I do actually eat Italian cheese, uh, this is um, Asiago, which is an Italian cheese that I can definitely recommend. Maybe not one of the best known names, but certainly a great taste. Uh, here you go. You can see the actual cheese itself. Evidence that I've actually been eating it. Um, so, what you need to know about Asiago. Uh, <coughs> when you buy it, it's important that it has a little red uh, stamp or logo like that. This is the in Italian, Denominazione di Origine Pro Teta. See, Italian is not actually my language, but um, this means that it's uh, cheese which has been made under certain controls <coughs> to do with the region, to do with the um, milk and the other aspects of the production. Uh, so it's good when you buy not just this one, but lots of Italian cheeses and indeed cheeses from other European Union countries to get them with these little uh, special logos which confirm that they're made in certain controlled conditions. Uh, the cheese itself uh, is obviously something you want to see. I'm going to have to move you a little bit. So here we go. Uh, oh, that's the kettle. You don't want to see the kettle. Uh, this is the cheese. Oh, that's still the kettle. Oh, I'm messing up my video. Never mind. Anyway, that's the cheese. What I was going to try and show you is, you know, I'm just going to cut a slice. Uh, something to know about the cheese is that it's got these little holes in it. Um, little air holes which form in the production. <coughs> the rind, uh, you don't really see it very much more, but the rind actually said Asiago on it, which is a nice touch and is also a um, uh, confirmation of authenticity. And the cheese itself, I'll just cut a slice. It's very light, lightly colored. Yeah, almost whitey, quite a mild, not very strong white, uh, rind, mm -hmm. very uh, light, cheesy smell, and as they say, the proof of the pudding is in the tasting, and the taste of this is, mm, is, is good. It's very light, very fluffy, tastes like a very high quality cheese. Sorry about seeing my nose, mm, I've got a halo now. So very good, light, fluffy tasting cheese, well worth a try, melts well, um, and I can certainly recommend it. So thanks for watching, see you later, bye bye.